Sorry. Sorry. Dare I go again? The creature in him bows. You look a bit seedy. Are you all right? I don't feel so good. I think I'm going into a bit of a slump. Oh, oh so, sorry, sorry. Oh, where can I put me face? See, when you say that, I, I, I thought you say... Yeah, uh, excuse me, I think I hear someone calling. I think maybe you say, I won't fight. Well, I bloody well didn't. That's the trouble with you people. You always think might makes right. <sighs> oh, sorry. We think you say fight again. Yes, yes. This is getting to be fairly typical, isn't it? Thank you. I'm just going to stand over there. Don't choke horribly to death on your beers or anything. Ah, oh, you'll be this bar's resident psychotic maniacs then. Yeah. It's manic barbarian gut squishes. We here to squish some guts. Maybe we squish your guts if you want. Just a little. Just for fun. Oh, oh, you want fight? Uh, no. Uh, no, 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 no need to trouble. I think maybe we kill him a little bit. Then drink some beer and finish him later. Later is no good. Want fight now. If we ask him nice, maybe he put the glass upside down on par and ask for his guts to be squished? You want maybe to have us squish your guts? No, no, look, actually I'm pretty much booked up at the moment. Still, um, uh, we'll see what we can do for you later, okay? Ah, and you gentlemen are... The Hublanders are being... Yeah, Hublanders. You maybe want to fight? What? No, 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 I don't want to fight. Not with anyone who oils his nipples, anyway. Uh, why'd you ask? Is very dull city. We won't be back. Yeah, it's too quiet. Last night we killed a little here and a little there, just indoors. I think maybe you kill twice in street too. Yeah, I kill someone in street. Only not much. Then we get bored and go out looking for a proper fight. You want fight? No, no, we have in fact been over this material before. Maybe we get fight here later when crowd get drunk. Yeah, you want us? Just turn your glass over. We pulverize your skull and squish your guts. Yeah, look, um, I'll just make a note of that. Excuse me, I think I have an astonishingly urgent need to be elsewhere. What are you two lummoxes doing here? Get out of my way. I think maybe he talked to us. Yeah, to us he speak. What we do with him? I say we take him. We crush him between our biceps. And we squish out his brains like icing from a tube. This one is no good for a fight, maybe. He wears a dress. Just hurt him a little. We get proper fight later. Well, I'll catch you later then. No, go away. I've had enough. I've just been beaten to a pulp without so much as an explanation. You keep your distance or I'll scream. No ghosts! No ghosts! Relax, son. I'm a wizard. Let me buy you a drink. So, um, what's all this about ghosts then, old son? In my room, a royal creature from the nethermost depths. It took me gate pass, and then it just left. Oh, I'll never forget the horror. Gate pass? Hmm. You said you'll never forget, as in you could give me a detailed account, blow by blow, so to speak? Well, yes. What? Just for the record, so to speak. Mind if I take all of this down? Well, shouldn't I lie on a couch or something? Feel free. Would it improve matters? Nah. Tell me about this gate pass. Gate pass? Sorry, did I say gate pass? Uh, tell me about this ghost. Oh, it was horrible. There it stood, all swirling and all spectral. A veritable vision straight out of the dungeon dimensions. It burst straight out of the doorway. I've got a weak heart, I have. I fainted clean away. Ah, oh, fainted without seeing anything. 
like the activities of this ghost, Vincent? No, nothing. Well, I saw nothing except it reached below my jewel box. Get the letter opener from the secret compartment beneath, then open the letter I'd hidden under the mattress, read the note inside, and use the combination in the note to open up the safe. But apart from that, you remember nothing? That's right. When I came to, my city pass was gone. Matches. Actually, I thought all wizards were supposed to blow smoke rings or something. I really must consult that script sometime. Oi, those are complimentary, those are. So why can't I take one? Well, you have to compliment the bar on its drinks first. But I haven't had anything to drink. That's all right. What are you having? Wugga wugga. Oh no, it's bursting open. Your face, your face of molten gold. Ah! God bless you, Val. My mate, my old, old what's his name? Hey, hey, it's you and me against the world, Polly. I love to drink with what's his name, cause what's his name's my mate. Hello? 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 Oh, yes. That's it, is it? That's the way you greet the greatest hero of our age? The one, the only, the invincible? You what? I'm important, me. I can't just go around answering any old greeting, you know? Well, how would you prefer I greet you, then? Well, shoving a pint in me hand would be nice. I'm Flea Bart the Incredible. Greatest thief in the multiverse. I've survived everything. I fought the ant god of quacks and he doesn't even exist. And I survived the valley of the scantily clad, amazingly well-hairstyled Amazon women. I've even escaped from the Temple of Othla, from which no other man has returned in fewer than three pieces. I don't believe a word of this. Huh! Huh! You dare to doubt the greatest hero of our age? I'm known all up and down the river, I am. The river? Yeah. The river Ank? Isn't that a little dangerous? You have to watch out for all the goiters and the yours. Yours? What's yours? Mine's another point, thanks. Then there was the time I blah, both blah, blah. Barky, a drink. And well, and it goes in a succulent month, it's going to be a rounded month, it's going to be a hot custard bath. Wild slithering, clawing a my And then we had some tea. Not? No, not particularly. Why? Just wondering. What is there to drink? Well, it's all a matter of suiting the clientele, friend. What do you think the sort of person who frequently frequents this bar would like to have for his drinkies? What'll it be? Hmm. Is this one of those tough, brutal bars? Yeah. Not through actual planning, mind. I mean, it just sort of develops. Then I'll have the usual. Uh, a glass of gin served at room temperature with a human air in it, please. Ah, yeah. I've just checked, and uh, we're all out of gin. Hmm. Whiskey? Um, no. Rice wine? Perno? Absinthe? Scumble? No. Old bowel bender stout? I think it's off, sir. Off? How can stout go off? It kills bacteria. You can clean privies with it. Well, it's more sort of uh, settled, sir. All the black colouring sort of swimming round the bottom. Same thing's happened to the elderberry wine. Well, I say the same thing, but it's more like lumpy. <laughs> it's probably all right, though. Ah, uh, thank you. So what have you got that hasn't got lamps in it? Oh, tons of stuff. Incidentally, sir, I don't know if you've noticed that rather impromptu pun there. <laughs> Rather good, I thought. It could have meant tons, T-U-N-S, type of barrel, or, or tons, T-O-N-S, in its colloquial usage meaning lots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very good, yeah. So, you've got lots, then? Uh, well, no, not really. <laughs> so, is there anything here to drink today? Well, yes, sir. It is a bar. I mean, not much use having a bar if there's no actual beer being served here. Today, we have beer actually on tap. That doesn't smell like beer. That smells like Zynemouth Lacantar Spinetic Emollient. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, it's very similar to beer, sir. Similar? It's one of the most deadly prescription medicines ever devised by man. How could it possibly be similar? Well, 
It is a liquid, sir. Well, I'm not touching it. I'll just have a glass of water, please. What? As in water taken from the River Ank? <laughs> You're braver than I thought. Ah. Oh, I see your point. Well, give us a Zymas Lacantar Spinetic Emollient, then, please. Old Uncle Benjamin's patent embalming fluid. Counterwires wine. Old Uncle Benjamin's patent stain remover. Hmm. Old Uncle Benjamin. That doesn't work. 